here's a little circuit I put together it's using this pretty old uh, speech synthesis chip here um, it's the SP uh, general instrument SP0256 and here's the ROM that goes with it so I put it all on the breadboard and it's kind of messy today um, well I put it on a breadboard today and it's messy so here's the uh, speech synthesis chip this is a little switch where I can tell it which word to uh, speak uh, the ROM has um, extra phrases these two were sold by Radio Shack and they were sort of set up for a clock so the chip itself has a ROM that can say the words 0 through 10 and then the ROM has extra stuff like hours and seconds and a few melodies so what else do we have here the circuit itself is this this part of the breadboard this stuff here is something else so you can ignore that and this switch as well although this little bit up here is a filter before it goes into an op amp to uh, amplify the sound a little bit and it's still pretty soft going through a speaker uh, using 5 volts but anyway let's uh, plug it in and see what it does okay got a little light there LED um, let us start out with uh, zero so it's gonna do the zero or the initial word when I hit the little button here you can barely hear it it's so soft it's saying oh oh and let's go to one maybe if I get the speaker up here closer whoa I just lost it okay let's try this and let's do I think I'll skip for this one and just go up to three instead of doing all the full binary stuff. Whoa. Let's try it again. Now, let's see what the... I can't remember where the melody was. Let's just go up here. Ooh. So what do we have here? We got three plus uh, four, eight, 16. So 19 maybe? 19. 19. Whoa. What's that one? If anything. Yeah, that's nothing. It's, I think I've gone beyond that. So let me let me put the speaker down and hopefully it won't it's gonna try to fall somewhere. Uh let's check real quickly. Uh good morning. Atten attention please is 31. So gosh, let's see. That's 32. I'm doing it with my thumb. I guess it's easier with this wire wrap tool. What do we got? 16. I need 31. So 16 plus 8. Whoa. 24. Uh, then I need another 6. Is that it? Yeah, I guess it'll be the one before 32. So that makes sense. <laughs> Let's get it up here and see if we can hear it. Attention, please. Now, in the beyond the words, it has some melodies. So the first one starts at 33. So I got to do. Let's see. Ooh, that one. Move all these others down. Let's try this. Is that big bin, I guess. And what else? 30, okay, so 33, 34, and 35 are the melodies. I'll do 35 first and then go back to 34. Ooh. Now let's do 34. So we get rid of the one bit. <laughs> okay. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, this is like a 40-year-old, well, almost 40-year-old chip that I dug out of my archives or, or my collection. 
Um, I'm hopefully going to put it together with an Arduino and I think this chip has a mode where you can send it arbitrary programs for the sounds through the serial port which means that uh, I could get it to say almost anything like some of the other chips, the AL2 for example. So I'm looking forward to messing with that when my Arduino comes in. Anyway, that's all for today.